And if you don't like long videos, guys, I'm so sorry. So, so sorry. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and for those who do not know me, my name is Mary Rose Amy. Welcome to my channel. So on today's video, I am going to be doing a chit chat, get ready with me. So I'm going to start from the beginning. I just showered, my hair is wet, I took a long shower and washed my hair. And now I'm going to apply my moisturizer, Kiehl's Hydro Plumping, it's a tongue twister. I use two pumps because why not and I apply this all over my face I don't know what's the function of this re hydro plumping um, retexturing serum concentrate but I love it um so I really love this product let me tell you I wait like maybe two to three minutes and then I apply the ultra facial cream as you could see I use it a lot I don't know if you can see it but I really use it a lot and this is the bigger size and I just do like a pinch of that because I already applied the Hydro Plumping Serum. So my face is already smooth and I don't have to actually apply a lot of it. And I just go in it again. Let me tell you, I love my skincare routine. I love it completely. So this is my current favorite um, primer. It's the All Star Matte Blur Primer. And it's like $12 or $8. It was one of both. And I love it, but I'm going to wait for my skin to like really suck the moisturizer and the serum and then I'll apply this one. And guys, school, I'm, I'm actually in my senior year now and let me tell you, I still have only, I have only one semester to go. Well guys, <laughs> it's so much. I mean, senior year is like working with a, having a part-time job and being in your last year or your last semester of school is really really tough i mean you can do it if your organization skills are on point you can do it but i'm not organized i procrastinate but i'm really really trying not to procrastinate because if i do believe me i will stay another semester and i don't want to stay another semester now that my primer has like sucked in my skin i am going now with something i'm going to try for the first time this is the asdi lauder double wear it says that it's stay in place makeup and it's for all skin types it has spf 10 in it and it's supposed to wear comfortably off up to 24 hours even in high humidity Aruba so I'm going to try it out for the first time I am in the shade 4 and 2 or spiced sand and I actually bought a Mac pump to not waste too much product it's not open it uh, it's a perfect fit the only thing that you would have to do is I think cut the cut the like the end. So I'm gonna do that now. Perfect. And then voila. So I'm going to be using mm, no, I have to cut it more. I don't wanna waste product. I'm just gonna apply this on my skin. Oh man, I think I cut it too short now. So I only did one pump because I already have some on my face and then I'm going to be using my favorite foundation brush which is the Morphe M439 oh my god let me tell you that brush this brush is so good so yeah this is the shade spiced sand it's like a tad darker than my face color but that is because my body is always tanned and my face is always lighter than my body and I don't want to walk with like a light skin and a dark body. Okay, so one pump is not enough. I'm going in with another pump. And for those that are asking me, I am not working out anymore at Strive for Best. Um, because I am like I reached a point where I want to work out more than three times a week and there i did it three times a week and i had to pay for um gym like an extra option because i did want to work out more than twice a week you know first impression 
for how much they are raving of this product I don't love it that much but we'll see throughout the day so I want to work out like five times a week or six times a week and there I only work out three times a week and I want more so I had I had to pay for a gym as an extra option and I'm a student I'm living on my own so I have to buy all my groceries for myself sometimes my grandma does help me and I do eat from her food but because I'm working out and you know grandmothers don't cook like for your meal plan they cook the way they want to and if you ask them to change their way of cooking they get mad so I buy my own food and it's really heavy on me to pay for that pay for a gym and gyms are overwhelming let me tell you that i don't like gyms because gyms are i get there and there's so many things that you can do that i get so overwhelmed and i like i get blank and i don't know what to do and i'm like oh my god i gotta ha get out of this place so i found a new place um it's like something new that just started because he's now independent he he wasn't independent and um I'm starting with him but I do love Tony Tony is like I would always recommend Tony he knows his stuff I just wanted more and it didn't fit with you know with my budget 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 it didn't fit with my budget so I had to like literally break up with him I've been with him for two years you know it's something for my body and it's my own goal so I had to try something new and it's been like two weeks at this new place and I do love it a lot the first week I went four times a week and last week I went six times and I'm going to strive for going six times again this week I really love the training it's almost the same as what I did at um, Strive for Best, um, but except it's on, on your own pace, so you do as much as you can. So if you want to go six rounds, you go six rounds, but I never <laughs> reach six rounds. I just reach four rounds till now because it's really hard, and I really, really enjoy it there. So I'm really excited for this new journey and this new uh, place that I'm going. Um, the guy's name is Fabricio and he said like in one month I'm, I will start seeing results um, I didn't really change the way I ate because um, I don't want to put myself in a diet where I will fail and start eating bad again I just want my you know my new way of eating to be just choosing healthy options and if I want to eat it like if I want to eat chips I can you know I, I shouldn't feel bad about it we're all humans and we all love to eat so I did my concealer with Colourpop concealer in the shade medium and now I am going with the loose powder in the shade banana and I am applying this all under my eye so I won't be like oh my god oh my body look I you know I will always try to always upload once a week because you know I really want to grow I always want to push myself to upload twice a week but you know I know that's not possible if I'm going to school I work part-time I have my like I'm starting to do my thesis proposal and I'm so you don't you guys have no idea how stressed out I am with that but I know I don't want excuses I have to work for what I want and that's what I'm doing so here I am uploading a chit chat get ready with me preparing for the day and uploading a video and I go in with my studio fix powder and I know this is a heavy coverage powder but I go in with like a big fluffy brush and it doesn't grab that much product and I like distrib distribute it all over my face I really want to like upload more types of video and not just like the sit downs talking with you guys and you know makeup stuff but the thing is where I currently live it's not pretty at all like I wouldn't want to put that quality of video on my YouTube channel because I feel that's not good enough if you know what I mean like my room is not completely painted my doors are not completely painted I have an old fridge in my room you know so I don't feel like it will look pretty on videos that's why I always like either this is my second time sitting down here and I do love like this setting and you either see me sitting here on my bed or at the vanity and I'm like getting tired of that and I want something new so I'm really excited to move in in a new place and 
I think we're moving in in like November either mid-November or the end of November hopefully and I'm really excited we're gonna have a kitchen living room our own room everything separated I'm so tired of this studio type of living I'm going to bump up my vlogging I want to do like what I eat in a day all those types of video I'm going to be doing my eyebrows now and normally I use my Mac paint um, fluid line in the color true brunette but today I don't want to like you know over exaggerate my brows I really want to have like a natural brow look and I am going in again with color pop in the shade soft black lightly like defining my brows I also like where I work out right now the time that I work out it's normally just me and Jennifer and I want to like take you guys with me one day like uh um my workout routine i think it's called so i really want to take you guys with me one day i know that the coach does not mind at all he's like really down to earth really like really motivating this guy is so motivating he sold me my my weight loss already he's like you're going to lose weight in one month believe me you're gonna see changes and you know I, i'm really skeptical when it comes to weight loss when people like really promise you stuff because weight loss is mostly like something that you have to work on yourself and I was skeptical because I've been in this journey for like more than two years already and I feel like I've been stuck for one year at this weight I was like we'll see I when he when he tells me that you're gonna see results because he's really motivating believe me you're gonna see results and I always answer him like yeah we'll see because I don't wanna you know believe something and then it doesn't happen to me and I feel like you know it's not working for me why am I doing this and then I start giving up and I don't want that to happen so that's why I'm really like oh yeah we'll see that's it for the fit life so um, for my eyes I'm going to be using born to run I grabbed also two MAC eyeshadows saddle and rule and I think I'm going to be using both of these and something shimmery from this palette. I'm not sure yet. Oh my god, I got inspired by Adeline Morin's video of my, like, I bought $970 of only yellow clothing items. And I was like, oh my god, I should do that. But then I was thinking that if I'm going to wait till December to see if I lose weight, to see how this training works with my body. And... If it does really work well with my body, then December I would love to purchase these clothes in my new size. My goal for new sizes is I want to reach a size large in the normal sizes because right now I'm an extra large or 1XL. I've been always, always in the plus size section. I've never been into a normal size um, clothing girl. Last year in summer I was... 0x but I never reached large so that's like literally my goal to get into that normal size section that's my I don't I don't have a weight goal I have a, like a size goal I think that's what works best because sometimes the the scale does not change and that's really demotivating and I'm using the brush M504 from Morphe and rule like all over my outer crease I always want to vlog like I always start my vlog I, I do I always start my vlog and then I do nothing the whole day and it gets really boring and I'm like I just stop and I know that's not the right mentality to go with I know if you really want it you have to work for it I know I lack a lot like I should have more consistency on my channel and I should upload more for my goals because it's not going to happen like you know magically and I know that I I know that I have to work hard I hope there's something that's going to click in my head and you know focus on what I want because it is possible to still grow on YouTube it is I mean a lot of people started last year I mean Remy started three years ago and she's like in 1 million subscribers if you don't have to give up on your dream I'm going right now with saddle and like below the orange I'm going to apply that going with a flat 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 brush which is the MAC 242 this is my favorite brush to apply eyeshadow like on the lid and I'm going with accelerate from this palette and I'm going to be applying this on my lid 
So I am going with this MAC brush brush. What is wrong with me today? I have I am having a hard time talking. I am going in with this MAC brush, which is the 239, and I'm going to be applying this under my lash line and like smoking out the orange which is rule mascara i'm gonna leave that for last i am going right now with the shade and light contour palette i have like a love-hate relationship with this palette i'm not sure if i love it or i hate it i just want to give it a try one more time and i'm going with the middle shade which is called shadow play and i'm going to be use it as my contour not as a bronzer and i'm going with my mac 168 on uh, my forehead and now i am going in with my favorite bronzer and you can see that it's i've hit pan I've, I've i've hit where it's like the end of it but i still push it a little more this is my favorite bronzing brush which is the mac 135 i love it like it's fluffy so you can really like you apply the product and you blend at the same time all right so i am going to be applying blush and highlighter peaches is a mac blush and if you want something really natural and something like subtle it's the perfect shade for our skin complexion and i think it goes well also with lighter skin colors and i like to apply it on my apples and go up with it so everything blends together for highlighter i go in with my mac global glow and i am applying with the mac 184 which is a fan brush and i go like see that I am going to be using Spice Lip Liner. It's one of my favorites. And now I'm going with Burnt Spice Liquid Lipstick. And if you don't have Burnt Spice, this is like literally, I think literally looks the same as Velvet Teddy. Which is another MAC product. <laughs> so now I am going to be using my Shiseido Lash Curler. And using my favorite mascara. Which is the MAC Giga Black. And for all of you wondering, like, where's the mukbang? Where's the mukbang? It's coming, guys. It's coming. Patience. And there we have it. The final look. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Do you like it? I like it. All right, guys. This was it for my chit chat. Get ready with me. I still have to, like, spray my face. I always do that final step with my all-nighter spray but it's all the way over there and i was i will just do it when i finish this video so yeah guys if if you enjoyed this video please give it a thumbs up if you enjoy these like long chit chat videos comment below so i can do them more often and update you guys on what's going on in my life and i will see you on another magical video guys Mwah. bye <laughs>